Hello friends, this is Dr. Abdul Mubin A. Mundevade from Mundevade Ayurvedic Clinic. In today's video, we will discuss the Ayurvedic herbal treatment for infertility. Now, infertility usually is uh, uh, described as uh, uh, when a loss of uh, or inability to conceive, uh, say more than one year after uh, uh, marriage and after uh, the couple has tried uh, to for, for conception uh, without using any contraceptives. Now, so now let us discuss the ayurvedic treatment. Now there are, you know, uh, you all know that infertility has many causes. So let's describe, uh, discuss the ayurvedic herbal treatment as per the different causes. Now the commonest uh, presentation of infertility is as follows. Now the commonest cause is uh, in the husband reduced sperm count or uh, sp poor sperm quality. Now ayurvedic medicines are unique in this sense that the, they can both uh, dramatically improve sperm count as well as the uh, uh, improve the quality of sperm and they are safe for a long term use. The additional bonus is that they can also improve sexual performance and uh, uh, treat erection and ejaculation issues. So Ayurvedic medicines can be used uh, very judiciously to treat psychological, neurological as well as vascular conditions related to impaired sexual performance as well as uh, treat the poor sperm quality or the uh, uh, reduced sperm count. Now, uh, anovulatory cycles, failure of regular ovulation is very common and possibly one of one of the commonest, uh, commonest causes of infertility in the female. Now, this can be treated by using simple herbal and herbomineral medicines, which act on the brain, thyroid, uterus, as well as the ovaries and bring about a regularization of the female reproductive system. Now, primary ovarian failure is also a common cause in young age and can be treated on the same principles. Polycystic ovarian syndrome is also responsible for failure of ovulation and this also needs to be treated. Of course, the treatment is slightly different. Now, blockage in the fallopian tubes and underdeveloped ut ut uterus or cervix, which is the mouth of the uterus. These are also uh, some common causes for infertility in the female. Uh, some women have uh, repeated conceptions, but the pregnancy is not carried uh, successfully to full term. Various causes can be responsible for this including chromosomal abnormalities, torch infections, sperm antibodies and an unhealthy inner uterine lining. So specific ayurvedic treatment is given according to the known cause and uh, uh, to bring about a successful and normal conception. Finally some couples have unexplained infertility where there is no known cause. Of course stress is a very uh, common cause in uh, nowadays uh, in modern times especially in working couples. This needs to be addressed. Uh, but when the cause is not known, we can give ayurvedic, simple ayurvedic medicines and along with that uh, give panchakarma treatment like basti. And the results are quite good. As I mentioned earlier, a blockage in the fallopian tubes and underdeveloped uterus etc. For these, a special type of basti known as uh, uttar basti is given. So combination of oral medication and uh, uttar basti or panchakarma treatments. These combined can help to bring about uh, good results and uh, bring about conception at the earliest. So friends, this is a short description of Ayurvedic herbal treatment of uh, the various causes of infertility. Let's meet in the next video. Goodbye.